so just going back to, I think I developed grit because I saw my parents. I mean, I saw them struggle. Sounds like they were very hard workers. Yeah, yeah. and they put through everything, and I think I watched that, and I think yeah. that influenced um, how I turned out. That so even when we uh, we have more, we have great favorable financial circumstances today, it came through someone's grit, yeah. and if it's the something. Right? Yeah. So, so, so part of it would happen by kids watching their parents, right? And a hundred percent. The um, research on this it was um, striking. It was done originally at Stanford University when young children watch adults do something, they do it, and you don't have to tell them anything. You know, like literally, you don't have to say, "Please do this." You don't have to say, "Like, I think this is a good thing to do." They just spontaneously model. Um, what what adults do. We actually model everything that anyone does. I think children are just especially sensitive to what the adults who really are, you know, I mean, what your mom does, you know, what your dad does. Um, and that means that if you're a teacher who wants to have students who are kind, I mean, you can tell them to be kind, but you better be kind. I mean, they see how you um, interact when, you know, visitors are in the classroom. They see how you treat other students. And so the modeling, I think, is the first and most important thing um, that adults are doing. And sometimes it's tiring, right? Like sometimes, you know, I'm the head of character lab and sometimes I, I don't feel like I want to be nice. Like I want to be defensive and I want to like, you know, but then I think like, oh, I'm the head of character lab and I have to be a good role model. <laughs> I have to be a good role model.